This is the Guinness World Records spiciest product ever created. And I'm gonna try to do it without a reaction. Don't try this at home. Take the extract. I still got it. Normally I don't do my videos in the bathroom, but today we got the world's spiciest toothpaste. And I can't even lie, I'm pretty excited about this one. It's just a little like regular toothpaste. Tomorrow, Pizza Hut comes out with a spicy lover's pizza. So to test it out, you know they had to give it to me. <laughs> Red jalapeno, spicy pepperoni, and spicy marinara sauce. The secret ingredient was in this box. New fiery flakes. Mm. Oh, you want some? I'm gonna give you this until it come out tomorrow. Share this video if you know you're gonna get you one. Comment the friend that you're gonna take up there to try it. And drop a chili pepper emoji in the chat for Pizza Hut one time. I'm sure that we all like corn nuts, but maybe not these corn nuts, which is made with all three of the world's hottest peppers, if you exclude the pepper X. So let's just try to eat it as fast as we can. If we can get it open. And to make it even worse, the only thing that I have to wash it down is a warm root beer. No cuts, no cap. It makes no sense why this is so good, but you're just gonna have to trust me. What you do first is you take a blue lemonade energy shot, put that on ice, then you take a couple gummy bears or more and then one blue shark and top it off with guava splash replenish replenish <coughs> if you ever want to eat something spicy but you don't want to deal with the after effects. There is a simple trick you can use to help. Peanut butter is a natural heat diffuser, and when eaten after your meal, it can help ease the sensation after eating something really spicy. I wish I would have known this sooner. Eat at your own risk. A king or a queen, what is going to be? Blue or pink, whatever you get, just know that it's a blessing. God don't give us what we want, He give needs. Love her or love him. Every decision is made for them. God should be the only one you put above them. When you hold him in your hand, I swear you. Let's see if my sour tolerance can live up to the sour pickle balls. I've heard that people can only do like one of these. Ah. <laughs> huh? I didn't know it was gonna do that. Let's show them how we do it. Share, copy, link.
Comment a friend that has to try this and your third emoji is your reaction. I don't even finna lie, these things bust, huh? I heard that the hottest Nashville chicken sandwich in Austin, Texas comes from a place called Tumble 22. So you know what we finna do. It's called Stupid Hot and it's the hottest one you have? Yeah. You can smell the heat just coming off of this thing. It just tastes good to me. Flavor. This is a 9 out of 10. The heat, you know, we'll give it a little, little 5. <sighs> but the hottest thing over here, gotta be that mac and cheese. Don't forget the bacon. I know you're somewhere out there, somewhere far away. I want <laughs> This is what happened at the Fire and Ink event by Pizza Hut. I met with a few followers, ate the new Spicy Lovers Pizza after they made it extra spicy. But it was nothing because you already know your boy is extra spicy. But after it was all said and done, I met up with Sean Evans, so I would say it was really all worth it. Then they tried to make me get a tattoo, but I chickened out and then went and picked one by random for your boy Lil Meech. I have yet to find a vegan pizza that I actually like. This one looks promising because it has pepperoni and sausage on it. Little saucy sauce. I'm done hyping my reviews and because it's vegan, I'm gonna be 100% honest. Mm. Mm. I didn't like it at all. Let's see how spicy that the Death Nut 3.0 challenge is that leads all the way up to the Death Nut, which is made with 16 million Scoville heat units. For the sake of the video, I'm just gonna eat all four of these at the same time. These are the first four levels. All right. Now for level five, regretfully hot. I'm gonna give it a little 8.9. 